the K platform, presented for the 1981 model year, spared Chrysler from the certain liquidation. By 1983, an extended K case had been created, the Chrysler variant was the E-Class, while Dodge had the 600. These autos have turned into everything except wiped out now, so this 87 600 car in a Denver territory destroying yard is a critical junkyard gem. Portage unequivocally thought about the presence of the late 1970s Granada to that of the Mercedes-Benz W123 in their publicizing, thus the ground was broken for Chrysler to make the inferences to Stuttgart hardware significantly more evident a couple of years after the fact. The name of the Chrysler E-Class was about as inconspicuous as a tire press hit to the kidneys, and the badging on its Dodge 600 kin left little to the creative energy. 600s originated from the production line with a few varieties of the Chrysler 2. 2 halves 0.5 motor, and additionally the Mitsubishi Hemi 2.64 chamber. This auto has the 2.5 Chrysler motor, evaluated at 97 pull. Base cost was $10,553. About $23,500 in 2017 dollars, the least expensive new Mercedes-Benz E-Class cost $38,600 in 1987, so there wasn't much client cover between the two autos. The 600s weren't terrible autos at the cost, however the develop quality wasn't exactly to Mercedes-Benz models. You'll discover this thumbtack treatment on most K-Car main events that still drive today. The inside is all tan and darker, with a lot of intense industrial velour upholstery and not really persuading manufactured wood. Aluminum confronted home sound hardware was extremely popular mid the 1980s, and the pattern spread to car controls. No tape in this auto, however at any rate it had AM and FM radio, even plain old mono AM radios were as yet costly choices on numerous autos as late as 1987, so the standard AM slash FM stereo apparatus in the 600 was an appealing arrangement. You can't beat the 600.